Here are some tips to practice your makeup skills. If you have a hard time matching your foundation, try a skin tint. It will match you better and it evens out the skin. Now a little concealer in a few different spots can go a long way. The amount of product on the wand is enough for the entire face. You can use this to brighten certain areas, but you can also use it to sculpt. Same goes for contour. I like to apply it to the back of my hand and then to my face so I'm not adding too much product. There are so many blush colors, but what I can recommend is going for something a little lighter and also something a little darker than you. It will give your cheeks this sort of sculpted look, even if you don't apply contour. Contour. Brows can also be super tricky, so I recommend starting with a brow powder. It has a softer look, so it's easier to practice with. Lips can also be tricky. I recommend going for something that has the same undertone as you, so either cold or warm. I love having a red, pink and brown lipstick on hand. Makeup pencils are great for beginners because they give you a lot of control and you can test and try where you want to place certain highlights and maybe also some shadows. They are also better for practicing eyeliner and looks in general because you can smudge them, you can shape them, you can feather them out with a brush and create a look that feels comfortable to you. 